When did it become so much us against them and tragedy? When did that become talking points that lead to even more division? In Vietnam, well, people, when they can't wait, they pee on the streets. When did we decide it was uncouth to share a toilet? Or that all gays are pedophiles waiting to convert children to exile? I just spent 30 hours traveling from one side of the world to the other. When did we lose the wonder of how amazing that really is? When did hate trump ingenuity? How in God's world did we learn to disrespect the president of freedom? Perhaps my head is still in the clouds. I'm still mind numb from being 30,000 feet closer to the last frontier. When did we forget the last frontier? I know I'm nothing, a speck in the eye of a flea. Why do I feel the weight of solar systems on my shoulders? In 50 or so years, everyone who reads these words will be gone, dust, a moat in the air. Why aren't we dancing more with our time here? and differences. Why aren't they what they are? Amazing spices that whets the appetite. Disjointed, I know, are these thoughts. Why is it that everyone who is sane is thinking the same things? I want to kiss hate. I want to hug despair. I want disruption to stand still under my feet. I am nothing, but I feel I can take it all in. And when I open my eyes to take a picture, I want the focus to be set on macro and the speck of dust in the eye of the flea. I want to be that extraordinary thing that the scientists of invention have made possible. Eye drops that dissolve discomfort at such a small cost. And then when I see better again, I want to change the lens and focus on the bigger picture. In Vietnam, I was a man out of my element. I, if I smiled, people were kind. When did we favor a grimace on our face directed at those who are different? Is that what the gods really want? Tearing each other up with a gaze? Or do they want us to add laughter to our dancing, that dance we only have a few short years to learn? Hey everyone, Jay Desmond here, and I hope that you're enjoying this new series that I've created of photography and poetry here on YouTube on my YouTube channel. It's a labor of love and it's something that I've been doing for many years, uh, that is writing poetry and taking photos. And I'm lucky enough to have four published books that combine my photography and poetry. I wanted to try something different. In fact, if you let me know down in the comments what you think about all this, I would have really appreciate it. Have a great day and see you in the world.